Setting up a calibrated jam peg for fastening of a complete stone is quite simple. First, you locate uh, the position. There's generally three on the platform, and you put the uh, peg as close to the lap as you can get it so that you can conduct yourself with sharp angles. Each jam has a key 90 degree angle on it. The idea of the 90 degree is proportional to each one of the slots for the different angles. The key is to locate the 90 degree line on the same even straight line as the center of the stone. That way you can cut around the perimeter of the stone. Once you have set this 90 degree line, your jam peg is already set up and the angles will drop into place as you change the positioning on the stone itself. Here are some more on setting it up, how to use a ruler to make sure that your 90 degree line is level with the center of the stone or set to, according to the radius of the intended stone as well as setting the jam so that the angles will work. Installing the jam on the platform of a calibrated jam peg is a cinch. Just have the lock nut already on the stand post threaded section and screw the stand rod into the metal threaded receptor in the platform. The receptor can be a T-nut, a helicoil, or a threaded insert. When the rod reaches the desired depth, cinch the nut tight with a wrench, set the collar shaft that controls the jam's height, and you're ready to pass it. The jam is shown here separately, but many jam peggers lock the jam plate directly to the stand rod and loosen the nut a bit to change jam direction. You can make your own special ruling device used for confirming the proper level of the all-important 90 degree line. Just glue a piece of ruler on the end of a small wood piece that is shaped to fit down flat on the lap while extending out over the gate and up against the jam. Move the jam up or down until you match up the 90 degree line with the desired measurement on the stone. Then lock the collar shaft into a place and the jam is in position for all remaining fastening. Is the peg absolutely horizontal when the tail prongs are in the 90 degree slot and the stone's girdle touches the lap? The best way to assure this condition is to buy a small bubble lever and lay it atop the quill while holding the ladder in the horizontal position. You'll know in a hurry if the jam is set to the right height for the stone. 